What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the general reading for somebody. So let's see who's going to get this reading. Scorpio. What's up Scorpio? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Scorpio as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. <clears throat> Scorpio. Okay, there's something that's going to happen that's going to make you nervous. I don't think bad nervous though. <laughs> I don't think bad nervous. Okay. I think good nervous. Um, I feel like it's gonna help you shed. Look at miracles came out again. It's gonna help you shed the old you. That's why that's why um um it's making you nervous because you have to release the old. This is good. All right, let's see. Scorpio, what's going on? <clears throat> oh, you got four cards. You have patience at the bottom of the deck. Yup. You have been waiting for this. Waiting for it. And it's finally here. Some of you guys didn't think it was, it was going to come at all. Okay. All right. So the first card you have is security here. There's something that you want to make sure is safe. Something that it you it's like do you want to make sure that it's yours that it's safe that's stable what is this security damn that flew out all right you have the four of pentacles the eight of wands in reverse with the five of swords and the ten of swords here so um whatever this is i feel like there's there's been a you're holding on to this though <laughs> you're holding on to it um but it's causing you a lot of stress holding on to it three of wands in reverse could be an aquarius doesn't have to be but your but your intuition is telling you that this is yours that this is your wish so what what is this ten of swords i feel like because things aren't happening at as fast as you want it to happen you're all up in your head like all up in your head like i feel like these thoughts are ridiculous like they're just jabbing 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 like negative 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 oh that's a cute puppy no dead oh that's a cute whatever no dead like <laughs> I know it's not like that, you know, but I feel like it's so negative just because, you know, things could be delayed a little bit, but you need to relax. Okay. I love you so much, but you need to relax. All right. It's it. it you're fine. <sighs> There's a lot of things going on around you. A lot of competition, a lot of drama. All right, in the midst of you also getting a new opportunity, and it, there's just a lot happening, Scorpio. Okay, all at the same time, and it's like you just like don't. It, it's like you're more, you're more, you're more focused on what's moving quickly, but maybe what's not moving at the pace is maybe what's not moving. It's because it, you need to, you know, have your focus on other things. But whatever isn't moving <clears throat> as quickly as you want it to, you're good. Like, you're good. It's yours. The star is here. The queen of swords and the high priestess. This is not... I'm surprised the temperance isn't here. This isn't like an over-the-night situation. This is your wish. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like, take your time. You know, this is what you've been waiting for. This is what you have been wanting. You know, like, it's not... Something is not going to happen overnight. Um, and to help with this um, negative thoughts, anytime you get a negative thought, replace it with a positive one, right? Um... Like, let's just say this is about, um, since a star is here, you know, like a wish, something that you wanted, right? A job that you always wanted with the Ace of Pentacles here, right? And you, you're you at the job, you're starting it, and you're just like, oh my gosh, like, this is like, you know, you're just like, why can't I get this code? Like, this code is so, it's so hard to get. This is gonna, this is not gonna work out. I'm gonna fail and I'm gonna lose, and this is just not, you know? And then catch yourself, right? And be like, no, no, no. It's okay. I will get it. I will get it. I'm going to take my time and I'm going to get it. I deserve this. This is mine. You know, tell yourself 
positive affirmations at this time because your thoughts are all over the place, but you're good. Like, trust me, you're good. And you know that. That's why you're still holding on to it because your intuition is telling you to hold on to it. But your mind is like trying to tell you to get out because it's not what you're used to, right? As I've said this before in another video. Our mind, our brain is connected to our eyes, right? And our eyes only see what's in front of it. Your intuition sees beyond the beyonds of all the beyonds. You know what I'm saying? So your mind is going ballistic right now because it's like, Scorpio, why are you moving like this? What are you doing? This is not the normal routine. What are you doing? And it's sending you freak signals like, get out, get out, get out. But it's not for you to get out. You know what I'm saying? You have to, this is this is different. This is also what the star card going to help you heal too. So that could be why the energy is moving really slow because this is not a, this is not a, a race type of situation. This is a sit down and eat. Let's have a conversation. Let's chat. Let's get to know each other. Let's bit to bit to, you know, like it's more of an in-depth situation that's happening here. Okay. So, um, yeah. <laughs> All right, the next card you have is a flow, all right? So you have to go with the flow. I I, th I don't feel like this is you, but um, like I got that, that this is somebody else going against the flow, going against the grain. And I feel like you notice it. I feel like you feel it. Um, Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, I feel like you're just like, it's making this person look very unreliable, very untrustworthy, or this energy, whoever it is. Could be a job too. Um, but I don't know. Let's see. What is this flow? This could be you too. Take it how it resonates. Bottom of the deck is the moon in reverse. Yeah, the two of pentacles in reverse with the six of wands in reverse. The knight of pentacles in reverse came out again with the five of pentacles here. Okay, so yeah, I mean, they're, it, it's actually making things a lot more harder for this person. Um, and it's, it's not going to work out for them that way. Like, I feel like them going against the grain is just going to leave them out in the cold because it's just going to, they're going to come off a certain way. The moon in reverse, the seven of wands in reverse, and the four of cups. But what, but what you don't see coming is that this energy is about to, re, is about to reveal something to you. Um, with the moon in reverse and seven of wands, I feel like they're going to stop fighting off. Like they're going to stop fighting their current. They're going to, they're going to start going with the flow and you're going to actually be able to see, see what was being hidden. Well, I don't think it's anything bad to be honest. I feel like this person is, um, with the queen of cups, I was getting like fear. Like they could be, yeah, the queen of cups could be a Leo here. Uh, queen of cups, the strength card, the four of wands with the ace of wands here. Um... It's like they are scared of commitment. They're scared of marriage. It, they just feel like it's too draining. You know, that's kind of what I'm getting. Um, but I feel like this is coming from them, their past with the Eight of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. You know, it's like they're fearful of that. But... With the Ace of Wands, they still want to. They still want to try with you, like they still want to do it with you. That's why they're gonna stop fighting this. But they're gonna tell you why they were fighting it, and I feel like they're gonna be like, "Oh, you know, well, again, this could be a job situation. It doesn't have to be love. Um, you know, maybe you were putting a certain proposal out there, and they and they were just like, no, no, no. Um, and now these people aren't fighting anymore. They're they're gonna they're going to take the offer." that you're giving or that you want or whatever. So they're going to give you what you finally been asking for. Um, and I don't think you see it coming. And this is love, the same thing. This person's going to give you what you want, but it's like they're they're fighting all the way up to the top because, again, they're, they're scared as F because of what happened before in the past. Okay. So take that how that resonates. <laughs> all right. The next card you have is protection here. I thought like this is the universe telling you that something is protected. Like you're not, there's something that's not gonna, you, there's a fear of something leaving, um, but you're good. 
Like you're, but again, this is probably the same thing as this. It's just you're, again, you're all up in your head. These thoughts, it's like you need double confirmation. Yeah, page of cups in reverse. Now listen to your intuition. Let's see, what is this protection? Show me with an Aries. Bottom of the deck is a Hierophant in reverse. You have the Eight of Swords, the Queen of Pentacles, the Emperor, and the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Yeah, I mean, you're in your head because you don't want to repeat the same thing here. Um, but the universe wants you to take control of a situation here and nurture it. Take care of it. You're good. You're good. The higher frame reverse, seven of cups in reverse, and the king of wands. What you went through before, um, what you went through before is not going to happen. You could have went through it with a Taurus or, um, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, okay, Aries, Leo, Sag. Um, I feel like you're in your head about that because you don't want to repeat the same thing. You don't want, you're just like, yo, I don't want to go back and be doing the same thing that I already did here. You're not. You're not. Um, I'm going to need you to be in this King of Wands and remember who the F you are. Okay, you've learned these lessons. Apply them. You're creating illusions and stuff and, and, because you're all up in your head. Okay, you need to get out of your head here. You're You're fine. Trust me, you're good. You're good. You're good. Trust your intuition. Heavy right now. Heavy. Okay. The next card you have is taking risks here. This is also, this is an Aries card too. So you can have that in your chart or be dealing with one. Um, taking a risk here. I feel like you should. I feel like you're being guided. And if you don't, you're going to get a real nice push. <laughs> okay. So let's see what this is. What is um taking risks? Oh. Bottom of the deck is a justice card in reverse. You have the hanged one with the star. Come with an Aquarius, the nine of swords, and the world. All right. Or um, Scorpio, Taurus, Leo. Um, yeah, I mean, there's there's a they want you to take a leap of faith towards your wish, okay? Because you close out a chapter and 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 it, it's like I feel like a lot of you guys could be feeling guilty. I'm also getting because it's like you close out a chapter and then here comes your wish. And that's why I feel like you're worried because you're just like, maybe I'm making the wrong choice because this was too soon. But I feel like you're good with the hangman. The universe is telling you to change your perspective. Look at this in a different way. Look at it as like this wish is also going to heal you. It's also going to help you grow. It's gonna also going to help you transform. Also, the universe brought this to you. You didn't go looking for this. You did not go looking for this. So also remember that too. The universe brought this to you, to your doorstep. They said, here, Scorpio, look at this. Could be a Libra with the, with the Justice card. Scorpio, um, Justice in reverse, the King of Wands and the Queen of Swords. Um, I feel like you just feel like something, it's just something's unbalanced because it, there's it's like two different energies. Like one's more logical, the other one's more passionate about the situation. But you, but um, it's like you need to speak up. Okay, I feel like I feel like you could be hiding how you really feel. So you need to speak up. And you'll see that I feel like you guys can find a middle ground. But absolutely take this risk towards this wish that you want. You're good. I'm telling you, you're good. All right. All right. Let's get some advice. All right, where's the security? You have lust here. So it's also very lusty, invisible. Yeah, but but I feel like it um I feel like it makes it's like I feel like because of the lust, it makes you feel like you were in, it's like, where were you this whole time? It's like, what were you doing? What were you being? It's like, whatever this energy, whatever that, that this thing that is not moving the way you want to, it's so lusty. It's so like passionate in a good way that it makes you feel like you were invisible every, like before, you know, um, you have really strong, um feelings or um intense energy towards this which is why it's freaking you the f out but you're fine okay you're fine it's moving at the it's moving 
it's moving at this at the pace that it's supposed to be moving okay what is this flow you have success all right so um differences fragment and deceit understanding and letting go yeah i mean this person again this person needs to do this I, th I think I told you this. It's like sometimes when people need... Oh, no. I, th I think that was Aries. If you have Aries in your chart, I'm going to watch that. But, um, you know, this person... They, it's like they need to go against the grain so that they can see how to be successful. Whoever these people were or whatever. It's like because them going against the grain, it's like they kept hitting roadblocks. Roadblock after roadblock after roadblock. And they're like, you just... you like, They're going to be like, you know what? Let's just let's just go with Scorpio let, let's see what Scorpio's idea is you know or let me go let me go back to Scorpio because clearly the way I thought this we should move this is not the way okay so it's like it's like this situation is funny it's like it's making you this is good though because I because I feel like the way that this energy is moving is it's moving real funny and you don't like funny, you know what I'm saying? So that's probably why you're all up in your head, but relax, okay? This is something way different is what I'm getting. Different than you ever experienced before. So just allow right now, all right? What is this protection? What is this protection spirit? Hold on. Protection. You have fulfillment. Yeah. Like I said, it's yours. Okay? You can enjoy this. Relax. Have a sip of wine. Have some pomegranate. All right? Stay hopeful. Oath. Make a promise to yourself. Some of you guys made a promise, but make a promise that you're going to stop overthinking this and treat the situation for only what you see with your eyes. Okay, not what your mind, I mean, I guess your mind is too, but, um, and give this a chance. You're going to have to move around differently, okay? But just because you have to move around differently doesn't mean that it's not for you. Doesn't mean that it's going to be the same thing as last time. You have to trust. Taking risks, spirit, what is this? What's taking risks? You have summon. <laughs> You're the universe is calling on you, Aries. You better take that leap. If not, they're going to push you into it. I'm telling you, the warrior, you got this. Why are you scared? Do you not know that you're... Come on. Did I say Aries? Did I say Aries? <laughs> you could be dealing with the Aries. I'm telling you, go watch that reading, bro. Um, the, the, this card is, the, is my Aries card too, but you are a warrior. You are a fighter. You've been through worse, Scorpio. So what's up? What's up? Don't be scared. All right? Take the leap of faith. You got this. This is your wish. Okay? All right, Scorpio. That's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this. And stay positive.